Okay. We find ourselves uh, right around this, this um, mini roundabouts that I've been testing. So I thought I'd run a quick test. It's the one on Park Avenue here in Long Beach. So we're going to make a right at this street and then down the street past the two mini roundabouts and see how it does on 10.2. Last test I did on this was on 10.1, so it's uh, it's time. It stopped. I'm telling it to go ahead. All right. A little model Y. All right. That was me giving it a little electricity to let it know. It's clear to go because it was stopped behind and didn't feel like it was ready to go but you, know, you got to take these while they're available especially in that street so I went ahead and told it to do so. It's now entering this and it's signaling and a lot more hesitant. Okay there's someone over on that side telling it to go. I did give it a little electricity to let it know it's its turn. That is a Mustang that's not a Maki. And all right. I don't see any real improvements from uh, into 10.2. So hopefully 10.3 will bring something else up for us. However, when we've tested these in the last few, the second one always seems to be better. So I'm gonna try to see what happens here. We're gonna go down to the second one and then do the manual turnaround and then uh, come back. person in front of us has a compact, uh, compressed natural gas Civic, which earned it a clean air sticker back in the day, the white ones, which is what uh, older battery electrics were on as well until they changed the program here in Southern California. So it's not because it's electric, it's because it's compressed natural gas. Basically, I think what you use in your barbecue, um, if you had a natural gas barbecue, maybe to cook in your oven or whatnot. Stove, stove top maybe. I don't believe that uh, any compressed natural gas is uh, eligible for any of these programs anymore. I gave it a little tap there too, um, though it looked like it was starting to accelerate even before I did so. So the next test is coming up in about a tenth of a mile. So it'll be the stop sign and then the next roundabout. So it's stopping a little too far. All right, I'm gonna give it a tap. I didn't know it's its turn. Apply strike, turning force, steering wheel. All right, if you look ahead, I think you, the camera can see that. It's the second roundabout. There's a pedestrian, okay, she just crossed. So we won't have to deal with the pedestrian on that thing. It's it's a yield, everyone gets a yield in this one. The car just came in at that side. It actually stopped, I'm gonna hit the accelerator. Yeah, so that's a lot more hesitant than previous versions. 